In 2020, a world-renowned radiation oncologist saved a Google executive's life. Now, they've teamed up to help women everywhere. This is the story of mission-driven tech. I'm Eve McDavid. I'm a cervical cancer survivor, a global public advocate, and the CEO and co-founder of Mission Driven Tech. I'm Dr. Onye Balogun, Assistant Professor of Radiation Oncology, specializing in gynecologic tumors, and Chief Medical Officer slash co-founder of Mission Driven Tech. Mission Driven Tech is a new women's health venture in collaboration with Wild Cornell Medicine, dedicated to the transformation of gynecologic care with modern technology. Overall, cancer survivorship is improving, but that's not the case for uterine or cervical cancers. Every year, 600,000 women worldwide are diagnosed with cervical cancer and another 300,000 women die of the disease. Cervical cancer in particular is preventable, treatable, and curable. It's enough. Treating these cancers requires the use of internal radiation, also known as brachytherapy. In cervical cancer, brachytherapy increases tumor remission, decreases cancer recurrence, and most importantly, improves five-year overall survival by 94%. Brachytherapy cures these cancers. So what's the problem? The procedures are excruciating and complications are common. Women undergo five procedures over the course of three weeks. And it's well documented in medical literature that the procedures are as painful as childbirth at best. I accessed the best possible care scenario for these procedures, and it was still impossible. This drives me to convert my background in technology and business to make this better for every woman who follows. And so we asked ourselves, why is it this way? It turns out the device is the root of the problem. This is the device used for brachytherapy. The tools have clear limitations. They were designed in the 1970s when women were not even included in clinical trials. These rigid metal instruments lead to an intolerable patient experience and devastating side effects. Moreover, they cause complications such as uterine perforations, poor device placement, which can lead to suboptimal radiation dosing, vaginal lacerations, and hospital admissions. In some cases, the cost of complications is even more expensive than the procedure itself. In a survey of 50 brachytherapy patients, almost all reported a lack of preparation, communication, and support. Further, more than 40% of women experience post-traumatic stress disorder from the procedure. As many as one in four women who begin brachytherapy will not persist. And when this happens, their tumors are more likely to recur, and unfortunately, they'll die. Our device, the Blossom, solves for the issues faced by both physicians and patients. We've designed a flexible, adjustable tandem enabling physicians to more easily navigate different types of uterine canals. You can also adjust it after you place it. It gives physicians the ability to deliver a better radiation dose, improving cure. In addition, these ovoids will adapt to a woman's anatomy, reducing trauma and complications that occur upon placement and removal. Altogether, these features greatly improve the patient experience and procedure safety. We're prioritizing device development as part of a full stack hardware software solution that includes a patient navigation platform with content from and connections to physical, mental, and sexual health providers. Cloud services will standardize treatment plans so all women experience the same high quality of treatment they deserve. In our initial polls with key opinion leaders, we've endorsed these novel features as beneficial in clinical practice. Empowered physicians with better tools deliver safer procedures with improved quality of life outcomes. When we build for patients and providers, everybody wins. But just solving for women undergoing brachytherapy isn't enough. 
That's why health equity is a core founding principle of mission-driven tech. In the U.S. alone, fewer than half of eligible women actually receive this treatment. In fact, black women are half as likely as white women to have this procedure and die at twice the rate. Our go-to-market strategy tackles key barriers aiming to double patient access and offer affordable pricing to every brachytherapy site, no matter the location. Mission Driven Tech is elevating women's health. In just 18 months, they've built a wide coalition of support. So how do they continue to accelerate? That's where you come in. We're incredibly bullish about the opportunity to revitalize this field of medicine and we want to partner with you to do it, to bring our groundbreaking, patient-centric, life-saving solutions to life. Women and physicians deserve better. Yesterday's tools just don't cut it. Join us as we transform gynecologic cancer care.